Hi, I'm Lori from Atlas Pilates in Seattle, and this is Ian. Our tip today is on the Grotz Wanda chair, and we're going to use it to show an easy way to stack the whole trunk. And most of us think that the trunk ends maybe at our waist or maybe at our hips, but the axial skeleton and the torso goes all the way under the seat, what we sit on. So Ian's going to turn the chair and make it like an actual chair. And it makes a really nice perch point and just tuck the spring in so it settles and have a seat right on the end. So you can do this on a hardback chair. Most of us don't really have that anymore. Or even on the end of the reformer. So sitting here is an easy way for the body to naturally sit up tall. So that's our beginning point today is that your trunk is all the way under your seat and you'll start by stacking up. From here we'll show how this applies on some other exercises. We're going to head to the mat. So you can have a seat with control. And instead of having the perch point of the chair, you can lie out, bend your knees to your chest, and hold this pole with your hands. And he's going to attach it right to the same point he was sitting on. So you're going to put the pole on these points. And Pick your head up, stretch one leg out, but keep both hip points on the pole and change. This is a great exercise. Almost all of us take the hip with the leg and the box winds up getting crooked. So when he extends, he's keeping both of his hips and that makes a square box. It lengthens the trunk and strengthens the trunk into the legs, where many of us start twisting our hips around and it's hard to get strong in the middle when it's wiggling around. So you can bang both knees to your chest and take a rest. And that's my tip for today. Thank you for watching.